All right, this is Derek here with MTG Lounge, and uh, we decided to put together some popper decks. I don't do popper very much, but thought it'd be something different. Uh, you get to use some cards you don't normally use, and uh, we're going to play against each other, but uh, I'll show you my deck here. These are my land, and these are my spells, so we'll do these first. But I seen the doorkeeper, and I pretty much wanted to I wanted to do something odd because that's what I like doing. So I seen the doorkeeper and I thought, huh, defender, and I started looking to see how many defenders there were. And basically, it's a zero four for two defender. You can pay an island and two colorless and tap it, and then you mill the opponent or well, target player. But in my case, I'm going to be milling the opponent for the number of defenders that I control. So I got four of those and. I got the Return Phalanx from Theros, two for a 3-3 three, three defender, and you can pay an island and a colorless, and it can lose defender and attack. So I have two ways to win with this. I can either win by milling or through life damage. So I wanted you know, two different win conditions. So I got four of the Return to Phalanx in there, so that's eight defenders. The Corpse Blockade is 3 for a 1-4, and I can sack a creature and it gets Death Touch. And I got two of these. It just gives me, uh, I can take something out that's big, or, you know, and, and it is what it is on its own. But normally I'm going to be using it to take something out or to keep them from swinging in with something. So I got two of those, so that makes 10 defenders. And then I got four of the Ogre Jailbreakers, and that's four for a 4-4 four, four defender. And it can attack as though it didn't have defender if I have a gate. So... Uh, I got four of those so that gives me 14 defenders in this deck and you just want to get out a bunch of defenders and then use the doorkeeper to mill the opponent or you can attack with this and the return phalanx and do damage that way so I got four of those and I got four Nimbus Nyad and this is a 2-2 two -two flyer for three or you can bestow it for five and put it on a creature and give it plus two plus two and flying and that is what I do with it. It's I use it more as a finisher or pretty much as blocking because I'm very vulnerable to flying. So I'm usually going to be slapping this on a preferably a jailbreaker or a return phalanx because that way if I want to attack with it I can. But if I have to, I'll put it on whatever I got to just to stop some flying damage that's coming in. I got four of those. You can I sometimes I will do the 2-2 flyer if I really need to stop some damage that's coming in, but what I really want to do is put it on something and pump it. So those are the creatures in the deck. And I got four pilfered plans, and right here you you milled the opponent for two and you draw two. So that's that's how I'm drawing some cards. And I also have two divinations where that's just draw two cards. So I have these six cards that are gonna help me draw cards. And I also get a little bit of mill out of these four. So, got those six. And I got two Psychic Strike, uh, counter a spell, and then the opponent's going to mill two cards. This here is for anything that's giving you fits, or I only got two in here because just use it as, just hold on to it and just take something out that really, you just really don't want to mess with. So, I got two of those in there. I got two Grizzly Spectacles. I destroy a target non-artifact creature and then they mill that many cards. Uh, normally you want to use it on something big, you know, because you're going to mill. They're going to mill equal to that creature's power. So, uh, just, it's what it's in there for. Uh, only two. Because the four costing, I was finding that it was just a little expensive to be taking out little bitty creatures. So, I just want two in there. And then I put two Quag Sickness in here. And uh, this uh, enchant creature, and it gets minus one, minus one for each swamp I control. And I got some swamps, so usually that's pretty good removal for three. And uh, I did try um, Death's Approach, but uh, you'll see why I decided against that one. So I got two of the Quag Sickness. And Shrivel, because like I said, I'm vulnerable to flying, or because of the Defender theme, I mainly, it's kind of a slow deck. So I got four shrivels in here to kind of wipe the board or just take out you know, some little things if I need to. 
so I got four of those and it can it can buy me some time I did have some mine rots but I was finding that later game I was having a mine rot and it was just kind of a dead card so I didn't really want any dead cards in here I mean I could maybe put it in the sideboard for like a control matchup but so the four shrivels helped me with that and then this here the crypt incursion exile all creatures from target players graveyard and I gain three life this right here really gets me back into games I, I sit there and mill them or whatever I have to do just to stay alive for the longest time and I'll take life and if I have one of these in hand I know that I can sit I can uh, get back in the game so this right here is very important and I'm running three of those so that's the deck and then I got four guild gates so that allows the ogre to attack and then I got nine swamp and I got 10 islands so there's 23 land in the deck but like I said it's built around the doorkeeper and you want to mill and then you get back in the game with the crypt, crypt incursion and I got some removal I got some uh, card draw you know to dig for what I need like I said the Nimbus Nyad you really want to slap that on something and have a big defender in the air or if you have to just put it there as a 2-2 and the jailbreaker and the phalanx can attack I mean I've won by through damage from attacking you know you clear the board out with the shrivels and you just start swinging in with your jailbreaker and your phalanx or you can mill them you can go long game so you have two win conditions which is important because if they take out your doorkeepers you're going to need an alternate win condition and that's what I was going for so that is my deck 60 cards I call it blue black defender mill Demir defender mill whatever you want to call it and I will test it against James and we'll see how it does and I hope you like it and be sure to rate comment and subscribe thank you